I mean, sugar. Why can't I have sugar? Why can't I not have sugar? I mean, why can't I have my, my candy bars and my peppermint and, you know, my, my chips and all my, you know, my, my different flavor color candies? I like candy. Uh, sugar is naturally in sugar cane. It's naturally in oranges and apples, but when you take the sugar out of the sugar cane, you've isolated and concentrated a substance, and that's called a drug. That's what we call a drug. So you mean I'm like a, I'm like a drug addict when I keep going to the bodega getting my candy every day? Well, you're a drug addict. That's bonafide. You have an eating disorder because you, you're eating all the time. If you drink all the time, you have a drinking problem. If you smoke all the time, you have a smoking problem. Now you're eating all the time, now you have an eating problem, which is a mental illness. The sugar, as long as it's in the sugar cane, it doesn't bother you. But when you take it out of the sugar cane, now you have problems. Because mm. the body's going to try to make it whole before it digests it. So it's going to pull wart out of your veins and arteries and nervous system. Mm. What I'm saying is if you eat a raisin, the body's going to turn it back into a grape before it digests it. Mm. So it's going to put the water back into the raisin and make it into a grape. Mm. So it pulls this wart out of your nervous system which causes Parkinson's, Alzheimer's, mm. multiple sclerosis, and it also pulls the moisture out of your joints, causing arthritis and stiff veins and arteries, arterial sclerosis. But the main thing that it's causing is you not to be in control of yourself. Mm. You got a chemical in your body that's giving you a false sense of intelligence. Mm.